are you clicking like this? <laughs> bruh, bruh, bruh. <laughs> well, by the end of this video, you'll be clicking like this. Also guys, we are halfway to 100 subscribers, so I will really appreciate it if you guys could just like and subscribe and even share this video with your friends, that would really help me a lot. So yeah, without further ado, let's continue with the video. Alright, so if you want to start to learn how to jitter click, um, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to um, have your pointer and your middle finger joined together like this. Why is this so? Be because you have more tension when these two fingers are joined together instead of one finger. You see, when I one finger, I, I I don't feel that it's strong enough, so I prefer to use two. This I can do, I can jitter consistently and and jitter perfectly, basically. Whereas one finger, there's like no tension at all, so I'm unable to jitter. Next, what you're gonna do? I'm sure you have seen this. Um, in YouTube videos if you have searched um, how to jitter click is that you're gonna want to tense your forearm what I find about this is that you want to only tense your forearm 50% like not all the way because I find when I I was tensing my forearm fully um, I couldn't actually jitter because my finger was just tensed and stuck in place unable to jitter so yeah that was my problem this is like what happens when I um, tense fully I, I can't exactly like get get like full full um, consistent CPS once I started um, tensing up only 50% I'm able to, to jitter consistently yeah like this look, look, look at how fast I'm clicking consistently yeah okay so that's how that's how you do it and also some tiny things you're gonna want to notice when you're jitter clicking is that your wrist is up not down like this um, I would say this is quite impossible to um, jitter so you're gonna want to have your wrist up you should you should notice this tiny thing um, when your wrist is up um, a lot of people like when they are first starting out they do not know how it feels like so one way to do this to get the feel of it is you're gonna want to try to you know jitter the table make sure there's tension in your fingers you can do this you can do this both ways there are tension in your fingers you're gonna want to feel that you know vibration exerted onto the table so yeah and after you you have practiced and and done all this you're gonna want to start shaking those fingers in the air and slowly just put them onto the mouse yeah and i would suggest putting it in the front too just, just a light touch would do it, like, like this, like, you can start jittering and yeah, a light touch would do because that's how I first discovered how how to jitter click. Just a small light touch on the on the key on the mouse key and that will do. Another thing I forgot to mention is that you will want to have your fingers only on the mouse. Yes. Anyway, yeah, fingers, fingers only. No palm. Basically, to summarize all of this, you want your two fingers like this on the mouse key, and your you want to tense your forearm. When you tense your forearm, your wrist should automatically just go up like this, and your fingers should not be touch. No, no, no. Your fingers should be on the mouse. Your palm shouldn't be on the mouse. So yeah, like this, your fingers are on the mouse only. And you should be able to jitter successfully. Look, look at, look at how fast I'm clicking. Oh, 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 yeah. So guys, if you're feeling like, oh, I just can't jitter click. It's, it's too hard. You see, um, I forgot to mention something to you guys. Um, it's about where you are um placing your finger on the mouse, and you want to place your finger on the lightest part of the mouse. So for the mouse I use for PVP now. Um, the lightest part would be the front, so that's how I actually discovered how to jitter click by just um, jittering my fingers at the front because it's so light that I could just jitter click like that. If you're you if you don't if you if you're not using a mouse like mine, 
and using something like like this this is my my dad's five-year-old mouse uh, it's quite battered up you can see the yeah the, the 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 thumbs have been there so yeah i got my i stole my dad's five-year-old mouse for this video so it's about the placement of the finger so judging from this mouse i'm i'm guessing the, the front is the front is the easiest place to click so you're gonna jitter in the front and you see it's not it's not impossible to jitter click it's it, it's a bit it's definitely a bit harder but but it's possible to jitter click so let me just demonstrate it again for this mouse yeah it's much harder on on a what's that on a business mouse like this especially when it's five years old and yeah but i'm just telling you guys it's not it's not impossible so keep on going i believe in you guys and that's it for today's video i guess Thank you guys so much for watching this and yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!